One of the areas often forgotten but most valuable fire departments is at the Youngstown Air Reserve Station in Vienna. Today, fire chiefs along with Red Cross officials and volunteers watched a demonstration of what the reserve station's fire crews do best. The 50 people invited to watch were seated under a tent at the Youngstown Air Reserve Station in Vienna, way closer than they would be if it were an actual airplane fire. The simulation was as real as possible. The fire trucks actually responded from off-site to show the audience how they set up. At one point, two firefighters, hose in hands, headed toward the flames. Going two in, two out for safety reasons. It looked dangerous. No, sir. We've been trained, highly trained. It, it is not dangerous. The demonstration called Feel the Heat was sponsored by the American Red Cross as a way to show people what the Air Reserve Station's fire department is capable of doing. This fire department of 50 people has everything it takes to put out any fire. From chemicals to our halon to PKP, which is uh, our dry chem uh, and foam. In a great facility. Uh, their equipment's second to none. I mean, Harold Maynard is the Milton Township Fire Chief. The Air Reserve Fire Department has helped him. We had a, uh, a large grass fire, and it was in a remote area where there was no uh, water facilities, and they, they did bring water to us. Mike Janikowski, the crew chief on the first truck in, has never used his training on an actual airplane fire, but he has used it. I had to put it uh, to use on uh, tankers, actual tankers off the highway. And we just really want people to see what we provide, and we want them to know that this support's here for them all the time. The 910th Civil Engineer Fire Department has mutual aid agreements with every fire department in Trumbull County, along with Youngstown, Austintown, and Mahoney County's Hazardous Materials Unit. But according to Chief John Lewis, agreement or not, they will help if needed.